Hey there guys, Zach here for Windows Central and welcome back to another video. Now today we're taking a look at Fragments. This is a HoloLens game slash demo that turns your environment into a crime scene and you, a detective, uh, you have to try and solve these sort of crime scenarios and uh, it's really quite cool. So let's take a look. Okay. We've lost the signal. Damn. Let's just hope we're not too late. The situation is worse than I thought. Director Kirkland will want to speak with us. Let's connect with her now. Please move into the glowing beacon to join the holo call. Please log into the call. You got the way? Thank you. Oh. Everyone's here? Good. I'm Jane Kirkland, Director of the Neural Investigation Unit. This is Sarah Barnes, our Biotech and Forensic Analyst. Nice to meet you. Hi. Ruth Halliday. Nice phone. Chief Technology Expert. Hey there. Unfortunately, there's no time oh, there to get to know each other better right now. I think there might be. The young boy's life is and he's counting on us. I'd oh like yeah, there is. Some footage that was taken from You're a press sitting on my computer morning. though. Take That's not the best place to sit. Well, he seems very worried. He's not even real. Hamish, this one's personal. Lady, there's Get a seat done. here. You could just sit here. Oh, they're done. And again, it was a hollow we call. Better get so started. She technically wasn't even Patience here. Patience is not the director's strong suit. Our technology will let you examine Lucas's recent memories. Once you're in, focus on finding clues. Go for any information that might aid us in narrowing in on Lucas's location. Okay. Take a look over here. Ruth set up this interactive map. We'll be able to set the filters on top to narrow in on Lucas's location. Oh, nice. Oh, very futuristic. I've also added the filters here on your objective board, so you can reference them while in the memory. Your current goal is also outlined. I'll update it as you make progress in the investigation. You may want to take notes during your investigation. I suggest you equip yourself with a notepad and pen, just in case. Ready? Oh, really? A notepad Good. and pen? What year is it, Reloading sir? Lucas's most recent it's 2017. Two. Nobody has pens One. or paper. Move your cursor over objects that look interesting. If they highlight, there may be more you can do with them. The gun. The gun's probably... Evidence. Not all objects are examinable. Nope, never it's the cursor not. Will oh, there's a post. Can examine an object. Can I examine that? No, I cannot. That wasn't there before. I can I can use voice commands apparently, but I'm not. I'll just tap it. When the cursor changes on a highlighted object, it means you can examine it more closely. Whenever you look at an interesting detail on an object, I'll highlight and label it. Phase three. Okay, remember that for me, guys, because I will forget. To help with the investigation, I've just updated your objectives board with the evidence Providence has detected in the memory. You can visualize what you found by using those filters up top. Just air tap while looking at one of the filter categories to select it. Then select the filter that makes sense based on what you saw in the memory. Just select a filter based on what you saw in the memory. If you're not sure, don't worry. Then you just look down at the map and that'll set the... See? Now that the filter's set, the map's been updated with a visualization of your theory. To narrow things down more, you'll need to set more filters. If you're not sure which filters to set, you can always look for more evidence in Lucas's memory. Just say, memory, or air tap the memory button. Memory. Because I've forgotten everything. While you're stepping through the memory, try to keep the map in mind. I'm getting some strange readings from some of the objects in this memory. Age divided by who? I'll update your cursor. If you Tin find one of these strange C. objects, okay. I'll highlight, and you should be able to interact with it. 
So it's tense, tense something, and I think that's what we need to answer next. So if we go back to the crime lab, there's a lot to I'm find. I'm glad that works. Think about what you saw in the memory. Tinsdale, that's it definitely other filters okay. to narrow this down further. We got it. it. Could still be any of these cities. It could be. We should set at least Trans one more no, phone area code. I don't know the phone area code. Let's go back to the memory. And we can find out. So there While was... you're stepping through the memory, try to keep the map in mind. We need to find evidence that will help you set the filters and find Lucas. Pause for radio. I don't actually know. A public transit ticket. Not sure what kind, though. I need to figure out where we are. The the, the area code. Oh, there's a phone number on here, right? Oh, maybe there isn't. I lied. If you're ready to go, just say, Crime Lab. You will be able to return to the memory if you need to collect more evidence. No, there's no number there. Um, can I turn it around? No, there's nothing on it. Okay, where are we? Let's try and Take find... Take at the objective board if you're feeling lost. Phone area code. The memory's stabilized. I'm pretty sure you've reconstructed what you can. How is this helpful? I need a phone number. Could there be one on here, maybe? This schedule outlines when the different transport services operate. Okay, well, there's no number on there either. That ticket the kidnapper has could be helpful. If the timestamp on it matched one of these three schedules, that could tell us how he's planning to move Lucas. All right, that's a good point. Let's figure out what times are what. Found new evidence around me. Uh, the schedule outlines when the different transport services operate. Train schedule. So coach schedule 6 a.m. to 11 a.m. Train schedule 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. Ferry schedule 12 p.m. to 3 p.m. So he's got. Can I get on the train ticket? Twelve thirty. So he got on the train. The departure time. We might be able to narrow things yes. down even more. The departure time. Twelve thirty. Can't you see it, dude? Well, I don't know the answer to this one yet. I do know, however, that the transportation network is a thing. And he did none of what? I'm gonna go for that one. Marking the main railroad tracks and the city. Once you think you know which city Lucas is in, you can select it to submit a scan. Right. <laughs> I, I won't lie, I still don't know because I don't know the area code. Um, right, memory. We've got to figure out. While you're stepping through the memory, try to keep the map in mind. We need to find evidence that will help you set the filters and find Lucas. Is that like maybe a receipt? Did you something? see a timestamp on the ticket? Uh, I saw a date. Timestamp. Yes. 2 12 pm. Although I don't see how that's helpful right now. This ticket's way beyond its expiration date. Oh, is it? Maybe it's not that one then. Not all objects are examinable. The cursor will change when you can examine an object. I do very much need to find out where we are, though. Let's just guess the city, because I'm you know which the city best this detective is in, in the... Uh, selected to submit a scan. That one. If you're sure, we can submit a scan. The director will review your findings. Well, one or three, maybe. Maybe a bit more than one. No! Uh, idiot! I just chose the wrong one! I should have chosen the one where it was raining, because I knew it was raining! The investigator figured out where we need to scan. No, no, I haven't. Go back. No, I'm sorry! I apologize! I clicked on Monroe, but it's not. It's probably south of that country. Louisiana, that's it. South of Louisiana. No, I'm sorry. I apologize. God, I'm so embarrassed. If you're right, Sarah's gonna have a lot of new memory data for you. I'm not right. I'm beyond wrong. I'm, I'm, getting a signal. Furth I'm the furthest I could possibly be, in fact. He's not I think it's the right. very bottom and I've chosen the very top. Damn. We, we must have missed something. Yeah, you might as well fire me now. I'm sorry, Figure guys. Figure it out and send new coordinates when you're sure. <laughs> okay. I've been able to eliminate some of the possibilities based it's on like all of the ones in the north. Between the memory and the map. I'm removing those filters now. We should rethink the evidence you found and re-examine the filters you selected before we submit another scan. How about I quit? How about detective work isn't for me? So there you have it guys, that's a quick look at Fragments for HoloLens. It's a very interesting 
a unique intelligent game where it scans your room it knows where characters are supposed to sit for the most part apart from that lady sitting on my pc um and it's able to just turn your environment into a crime scene which is very impressive but yes oh he is sitting look there you go he's sitting on my sofa look at you chilling out Wait, what are you looking at there's nothing over here hey, now you're looking at me so yeah but guys thanks so much for watching and i shall see you in the next one bye bye There, that rat. You can see it, can't you? Excellent. It's part of the memory. I'm loading the rest of the memory now. The crime you are about to witness happened a few moments ago. I don't know what you'll see, Investigator, but your first case has begun.